Hi, I'm Deep Tan. Today I want to share with you a vision that I received recently during worship. Um, at the beginning of this year, we began to feel that there is a stir in the spirit and we begin to feel that there is a shift in the spirit. And we also began to feel that there is a, a wind that is picking up. So just recently in June, when we were in worship, I saw that as we were worshiping God and our worship rising up to heaven, there is a stirring of a wind. And it looked like a whirlwind, but it was not ferocious. It was very gentle. It's a stirring of a wind. And I looked and I begin to see people who were bound and shriveled up, begin to extend like the sail of a boat. And they begin to open up like a sail of a boat. And I see this wind begin to pick up and all this sail, these people were beginning to open up to the wind, just like the sail was starting to get ready for the wind to come and propel them. And I felt with this vision, God was speaking to us that as we worship, as we worship, yes, we worship God and He enjoy and delight in our worship. But also there is a power. There's a power release in worship. There's a power that creates a renewal wind that's coming to sweep across this land. So we would like to encourage people to increase worship in their lives. Don't wait for Sunday. Don't wait for a church service. Don't wait for a prayer concert. Gather a few people together. Two, three, four, five people. Just give God the worship because there is spiritual power in worship. We're releasing a wind that is awakening people who were disappointed, who were broken, that's awakening destinies. And I felt this vision spoke to me about there is that wind that is created in worship that will restore destinies. People who have been hurt, people who have been disappointed, that have closed up. But as the church begin to worship more, as the believers begin to worship more. We are releasing the presence of God, the wind of the Spirit to stir up and propel these people who are beginning to open up and they then again will go and sail into the destinies. There is a time now for restoration of destinies. So friends, encourage us to worship more, to worship more. There is power in our worship of God.